Yo, what's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. My name is BTD and yes, I'm back making more videos and if you guys have been following me on like Xbox and PC and things like that, you'll know I've been playing a lot of GTA 5 recently and this got me wondering about reliable sources and everything we have for the next game being GTA 6. So without further ado, let's get in to see what we can find out about the new Grand Theft Auto 6. As some of you guys know, we've had not had any information or news being given about GTA 6, but there's definitely been a few credible articles that we can look through to find out what we could expect from the next game in the Rockstar franchise. As you guys know, uh, this is a credible source, which I'll leave down in the description down below if you want to read it for yourself. And yeah, it's definitely outdated by a couple of months. So I'm not sure whether things have been updated since this article, but this is the article I'm going to go off by myself so without further ado let's get into the first thing being the locations which gta 6 can be placed in so we've got four locations that gta 6 could be uh put into and that could be miami coming from the one of the games i like the most being vice city we have vegas being san andreas and chicago and detroit as well as mexico city being the first time it could come out of the united states but technically it's still in the u.s but Theoretically, no, it's not. Now, me personally, I think the obvious choice would be for them to go back to Vegas, where San Andreas was first introducing, as that was the, probably the most popular game in the series. But I don't know. So hopefully, we can see something from there. What do you guys think, and where do you think it will be uh, positioned? Because Chicago and Detroit, I'm not too sure. I know they're a bit like a heavy city type place, but I think we've already had that from Los Santos and maybe we will see it go somewhere else but I'm not too sure guys let me know I know there's been other sources where they've said like um GTA could possibly go to Tokyo and things like that but like for me personally I would expect them to come to the UK but I believe was it the first GTA or the second GTA um that it was based in the UK if I'm not mistaken and yeah would they come back i'm not too sure but we have heard from other sources that rockstar have wanted to keep themselves in the u.s for cultural reasons i guess that way they can focus around um what they know personally and not have the issue of people coming to them saying you've done this wrong and that wrong but who knows guys leave it down in the comments what you guys think of that thing and let's go on to the game release and the pre-production and what's been going on there so as you guys know, if you're into your games and how they're made, you'll know that a game has a pre-production line, basically. And from the start of 2015 to 16, we know that people, it's only been a little tiny group of like 10 to 20 people uh, starting the project of GTA 6, where they've been scouting areas and trying to get a handle on the, uh, the storyline and possibly the online as well. But we have been told by a reliable source that GTA 6, the latest it could be released, would be 2022. So, theoretically, we still got a long time to wait until the next game comes out, seeing as GTA 5 was released back in 2013. So that was nearly five years ago. Yeah, five years ago, just making sure. So yeah, I think that's a bit of a long time for a GTA game, but of course, the game's getting bigger, they need to add more things into it. So we can understand why it would take so long for it to come out. The next thing I've seen on a few sources is the fact that we could see our first female lead character in a GTA game. Now if you guys know in GTA 5, especially on the online, you are able to customise and create and move around with a female character. Now will this work with a GTA series where it's predominantly male players? I know obviously there's going to be female people that play the game, but majority I'll say are male, but it's good work. And would, coming from that, would it work with a three character thing like they've done GTA 5 or would it just be one person, uh, female or male, that has been led throughout the game? I personally think that GTA 6 would do well as a three way character scheme like they did for GTA 5 but obviously mix around the gender and things like that just you know cope with other people and obviously they can add different storylines for that type of situation but there's more for us to see from that but hey ho i think it works really well seeing as it gives you different ways to go about and move around los santos i think with trevor franklin and michael but that's my personal opinion i do not think we will see uh franklin trevor or michael come back again seeing as at the end of the storyline you say you hear michael say he's getting a bit too old for this so i feel in the next game like the dumb of all the games you'll see different characters but guys that's going to be it for today's video guys if you want to see any more 
leave it down in the comments of what you want to see hopefully i would do a lot more gta content because that's what i'm really liking at the minute but yeah let me let me know down in the comments what you guys think of the next location will be miami vegas chicago and detroit or mexico city somewhere different but i'm not too sure guys let me know down in the comments but for now i'm out hit the like button if you're new subscribe and i'll see you guys later peace